Hello everyone, welcome. I'm Adam and uh, in this video I'm going to show you how you can create a A350 uh, in your sim uh, for any version of prepared. This should work. I'm, I'm in version 5. Um, the A350 is a freeware plane you can install and um, I've merged it with the Quality Wing 787 flight deck so it has a high quality flight deck as opposed to the real rubbish flight deck that came with this model. Um, so I'm going to show you how you need to install it. There is a patch file that you'll need to grab from my Discord, uh, which contains like PBR files and um, the sort of transitional stuff to make the quality wings work. I'm not giving away any um, payware files, so you need to have them already. <clears throat> so this requires you having the Quality Wing 787 already installed. There is a link down below if you haven't got it to head over to their website where you can actually download the 787. You can purchase it, download it. It's version 1.4.0 that you need. There's a second link down below to go to the Rico website to get this freeware model, which um, is basic at best, but um, I've sort of redone it to make it look a lot better so um, the files in my discord is a patch file that goes in after you've installed the a350 and in all honesty i probably would say install it to a dummy location first so um, this here is uh, the, the patch file uh, we'll come back to that but this is my dummy location that i've installed the a3502 <clears throat> you can install it straight into your sim, um, but the file name here will need to be changed to the dummy file that I gave it, which is Quality Wings A350900. Um, once you've done that, then you can delete a few uh, items here. We don't need that. We don't need the panel, the sound. You don't need the aircraft CFG or the uh, air model for it. So they can all be deleted. This is the American Airlines. I've already done this one, so that's already been done. Um, and that's about it. Uh, from this model bump here, you want to take the um, FSPX A350 bump model. And you want to take it and cut it out. And place it in the model RR folder. Uh, so you'll have a patch folder. And you want to place that in the patch folder. And then put the, this file in that model RR file. If it's not already there. Once that's done, uh, these can be deleted. All three, because there's already a model in here. So they can be deleted. Them three. Go into your um, whatever liveries you want, basically. So if you look inside here, there is a texture file. Don't worry about the readme. But there is a texture file here. Um, and if you look at the, 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 the call location to it, it says here, scenery, uh, texture, scenery, and all this, right? That's incorrect. The one that I've put here in Texture AA is going to the quality wings. So basically, this texture file needs to be in any single one of the livery folders you want. So um, just copy from the first one that I've done and paste it in any one of these that you want. So if we wanted Cathaway, we would just basically copy and paste not a shortcut copy and paste and overwrite the file and now this one will show up as it should um, and do it for every single one the reason I haven't already done this for you is so you don't have to have all these installed already you can delete off the ones you don't want um, and not have a massive 
herd of files inside. Um, once you've done that, you need to head into your Quality Wing 7879 folder and take the Rolls Royce RR AIR file here, copy this and pop this in uh, to your installation. You also need the True Glass and the Real Light folders, copy those and paste those in. And that's basically it. Um, oh, and the Model RR, you need the Virtual Flight Deck. Copy that and paste that into the Model RR folder here. So the way you need to do it, just for if there's anybody who's confused here, install the 787, install the A350, delete the folders from your A350 folder that I mentioned before, put my patch folder in, okay? And then put transfer across the AIR folder, the True Glass folder, the panel or the real light, sorry, folder, into the A350 folder and your virtual flight deck from the 789 from your quality wings. Once you've done that, you, I mean, you'll have a lot more folders in here. Basically, all of the, I've done the first one. So I've done the American Airlines one. Um, but you can choose which liveries you want here. So if you want, let's say, Cathaway here. Or actually, uh, if you want the uh, uh, Qantas here, so the texture file here has a fallback to the wrong location. So what we need to do is go into the texture AA folder, copy this CFG file, and overwrite this one. This one has the correct fallback to the uh, quality wings. Okay. So, once you've put that in, uh, you can do it for as many liveries as you want that are contained within. And once you've done that, um, you're good to go, basically. Everything is set up to utilize the Quality Wings flight deck with the A350 exterior. The only thing I will say that um, can't be implemented is the night lighting, sadly. Um, Quality Wings implements their taxi lights and their uh, landing lights a little bit differently, so they can't be attached to this model. And these ones that came with this free model, sadly, are not PBR'd. And when I try and add it to add my own landing lights, it completely excluded these ones and nothing showed up so sadly that is it it's a daytime flyer only basically anyway this at least gives you an a350 exterior which is a, a you know an okay one at the end of the day it's not like the best but it's uh, a flyable copy and it does work like we can go for a quick flight if we want uh parking brake off that's not a parking brake that's the parking brake um engines hoy like it does work we need to set some flaps i mean things are going to kick off because i haven't set this plane up correctly but uh in fact let's just take off from here yeah we're taking off mate just deal with it it will all the sounds work uh the flight deck works the lighting works um Everything works, really, so even the, the the guy here. Too low flaps. Ah, we're, we're all right, we're all right, we're all right. Let's take her to the air, shall we? Can we take her to the air? And she lifts off. No tail strike, no tail strike. There we go. She's up. Let's get her in. So if anybody's unclear of what you need to do, the recap here is to step one, download and install the Quality Wings um, 787 using the link down below and the freeware A350. Uh, installing the freeware one to a dummy location first. Um, 
and then taking uh my uh, going into the the a350 deleting those folders and files that we mentioned before um then taking my uh, my patch file and just literally copy and paste it in overwriting any files it asks um then step three is to go into your quality wing 7879 folder copy the air for the rolls royce engines and put it into um your a through new a350 folder going into also the model rr folder taking the virtual flight deck copying that into your folder here um then in the texture aa folder uh, cfg file texture here that you need to copy into any of these liveries that you want it to show up in um, if you want them all then just copy and paste the texture folder into every single one of these overwriting the one is that is in there and once you've done that that is it you will have a a350 um 900 um and I, i've just written the word quality wings on this one just so it's it's easy um and finally the last thing you need to do is go into your dummy location and take all of these and cut them and go into your p3d installation and paste them in and it will then appear like it should if we scroll down like this with all the files gauges and everything you need uh there and that's it basically that is everything uh you'll have a flyable a350 um working uh no problemo um the patch fo folder is in my discord there is no payware items in that patch file that patch file is literally just uh cfg files to connect the payware to the freeware so uh enjoy the a350 it's a basic one but at least it's an a350 and i'll see you in the next video guys don't forget i give away 50 euros of flights and vouchers every single month to be in with a chance to win all you have to do is subscribe to my channel and leave a comment down below in any one of my videos and at the ev end of every single month i go live with the vlog and i announce the winner who will get 50 euros to spend on sim market flight sim add-ons take care i'll see you in the next one bye bye